Hello, I'm Bobby Galuba with Ubitech.com, and welcome to my third video, recorded on Sunday, March 29th, 2015. In today's video, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to disable write caching on your hard drive to reduce the chance of data loss or corruption on your hard drive. So, this video um, I'm recording with Windows XP, and Windows XP hasn't been supported by Microsoft since about or excuse me, since about April of 2014, but I know there's still a lot of die-hard Windows XP users out there, and this tutorial will also apply to newer operating systems, just the uh, path that you have to take uh, and the things that you have to click on may be slightly different. So the first thing we want to do to disable write caching on your hard drive is to single left click on the start button at the bottom left hand corner of your screen, single left click on my computer and now keep in mind that uh, what you see in this window may be slightly different depending on what folders you have and what view settings you have enabled but the basics may will probably just look the same so what we want to do is single right click on local disk C single left click on properties then single left click on the hardware tab and the next thing we want to do is make sure that uh, our hard drive is selected in this all disk drives list and if you see here my hard drive is already selected and it's highlighted in blue this is it's the one that starts with ST so the next thing you want to do is single left click on properties then we want to single left click on the policies tab and if you see here, there's a check mark in the Enable Write Caching on the Disk checkbox. And go ahead and read this down here. It says, this setting enables write caching to improve disk performance, but a power outage or equipment failure might result in data loss or corruption. And what a write cache basically is, is it's a, an area in the hardware that a program can write data to quickly and assume that the data has already been written to the hard drive even though the actual hard drive may not have written it out to its disks yet and that's good to improve performance but if you have a power glitch or um, a loss in power and if that data has not already been written to the disks from the cache the data on the hard drive may become corrupted and that could cause all sorts of problems so to reduce the chance of data loss or corruption, you want to single left click on this green check mark to remove it from the checkbox. You want to single left click on OK, then single left click on OK again, and there we go. And let's just confirm, let's go back and confirm that we've actually done that correctly. So again, single right click on local disk C, single left click on properties, single left click on hardware, make sure your hard drive is selected and we can see that the hard drive is selected because it's highlighted in blue single left click on properties then single left click on the policies tab up at the top then if you see here the check mark has been removed which that indicates that write caching is disabled so let's just click on OK again or we'll single left click on OK once more and there we go. Now on some systems you may see a noticeable decrease in performance. Um, so if you do and if it if you not if you're not happy with it, go back and re-enable write caching. But for most systems that I've done this on, um, I haven't noticed a, a, a decrease in performance. But those of you who have applications that access the hard drive a great deal may see um, a significant decrease in performance and you may not want to do this. So thanks for watching and I hope you learned something. Take care.